With an early and intense start to the wildfire season across the state, fire officials are reminding you to do your part when it comes to keeping your own property safe. You may have heard of the concept of defensible space, but might not know where to start. Fox 12 So Young Kim joins us live from Beaverton with some tips on how to protect your home or your business. So Young. Nora Anna with wildfire season in full swing here in Oregon. Authorities tell me they want people, even in urban areas, to take fire danger seriously. With the summer heat, coupled with the dry conditions, people who live in the Portland metro area say fire danger is top of mind. Most of the people are, are really concerned. Well, we don't burn anything. We don't not even run in the barbecue. Neighbors in Milwaukee say they try to keep any fuel that could pose a threat away from their property. They try to keep the weeds down as far as possible and uh, just clean up the area. Fire officials say that's exactly what they hope everyone will do. Lieutenant Jill Fullerton with Clackamas Fire is reminding people about the importance of creating defensible space to give your property a better chance should a fire break out. Maybe if you don't even have a fire directly near you, you may get blowing embers from a nearby fire, whether it's a, a car fire, a structure fire, um, a brush fire that may be in the neighborhood. By eliminating the sources of ignition around your home, then you can really protect. So what are some things you can do? Oh, on some of your larger trees, they recommend taking a uh, limbing up at least a third of the tree, getting getting kind of that vegetation up six to ten feet um, in order to prevent the smaller fuels that you see on the ground from carrying up the tree into into the canopies of the trees. Fire officials say removing sources of fuel from your property is the best way to go large fuels with chunks of trees. We've got uh, kind of brush piles, again, of all dead, dead materials, which are very flammable. And so getting these off the property is really your, your best chance of creating that survivable and defensible space. Now back out here live, fire authorities also recommend doing some research on the plants you choose to keep around your property. Some are more flammable than others. We'll have a link to more resources and tips in this story on our website, kptv.com. Live in Beaverton, Sun Kim, 12 Oregon.